does PRP injection, which is platelet-rich plasma or the fancy P shot, does it help in erectile dysfunction? Yes, it does work. It has a lot of uh, growth factors which is there in the platelets which are delivered to the penile tissue and which improve the erectile function. It's lot of it's under investigation, but the preliminary results it say yes, it does work, and it will lot about it will be known to us in the future. Yeah, so erectile dysfunction is on the rise, and uh, uh, anywhere between 20 to 60 percent of the patient, depending on the age, they experience erectile dysfunction, and PRP is one of the solutions to treat erectile dysfunction. And many patients would like to try the non-surgical option before going in for any uh, surgical treatment for erectile dysfunction. So PRP is platelet-rich plasma and see normally the blood has many components. It has red blood cells, white blood cells, platelets and the plasma. So what we do is we take around 20 ml of the blood from the patient, from the, from the hand and then we keep it in the centrifuge machine so that these components get separated. So what we use is the plasma and the platelets. So that's why it's called platelet rich plasma. So these uh, platelets, they have the growth factors which are very important for any new blood vessel formation. So we use this plasma and the platelets and then this is uh, injected into the penis not to get scared, these are relatively painless. We give a small injection before so that we make the penis numb so that you don't experience pain when we give the PRP injection. We use some of the best platelet concentration system to maintain and achieve the best uh, platelet counts inside our uh, platelet plasma. And then we inject it into the penis. There are absolutely no side effects, your own blood and uh, your own uh, platelets are being injected inside your penis only things you are going to get is the results yeah so dr Vaseem, i think uh, many patients get confused which prp to use so there are prps available for as low as 1000 rupees and there are good prps available for uh, approximately around uh, 20 to 25000 rupees so the protocol that we follow and uh, we are also conducting the study as well. So wherein what we, our protocol is, we give uh, two injections of PRP one month apart, and then we usually expect improvement three months after the second injection. So that's how we assess, we uh, give different questionnaires to assess how uh, objectively the patient is seeing the improvement. So how long does it take Dr. Vaseem to do all these procedures? How long it are we taking? It takes around 45 minutes to yeah. collect the blood from your veins, process yeah. it and then it, the injection it only takes around 1 or 2 minutes and you can go home as soon as the injection has been given. Yeah, so it takes basically an in and out 1 hour procedure yeah. and, and, and the, all the major studies have shown that the PRP is definitely safe. The efficacy is still evolving. And as per the American Urological Association and the European Urological Association guidelines, all have recommended that PRP could be used as a restorative therapy in the treatment of erectile dysfunction. And hence, more and more studies are being done. The data is still evolving. And then, yeah, many of our patients are very happy the way uh, they have experienced improvement in their erections after the uh, PRP injections. So the side effects of platelet-rich plasma during the injection can be mild pain, there can be some hematoma which is completely treatable and talking about the re-injections, there may be some patients who will require re-injections after a year or two later. So for example, when a patient with erectile dysfunction comes, so we the first line option is always the tablets, which is like acildenafil or a tadalafil tablets. So when they don't respond to that, we usually give an option of the PRP injection. And uh, what we have seen in some of our patients who are receiving PRP injection is that those patients who did not respond to the tablets in the initial part of our treatment, they started responding after the PRP injection. So basically they have become PD-5, the tablet responders after the PRP injections. So what I'm trying to say is, so after PRP, they did not see improvement spontaneously, but when they started the tablets, so they saw significant improvements and then the tablets were helping them to get to achieve good directions. Okay, so overall uh, to summarize, 
I think the PRP is, is a new thing in the field of male sexual medicine. Like already said, it's being used vastly in many specialties. Uh, I think it's most uh, widely used in by the dermatologist for the hair loss and also by orthopedic doctors for the knee joint uh, treatment and chronic uh, pain syndromes. So I think uh, it, it is going to take a big turn in the management of erectile dysfunction. And I feel that uh, patients before going in for a, a penile implant surgery, so a, it's, it's a good option that they can uh, try the platelet rich plasma, which is the PRP or the fancy term is the uh, P shot for the erectile dysfunction. It is used in many other conditions in andrology like Peyronie's disease as well, uh, but it's more frequently being used in the erectile dysfunction. Any last few words, Vaseem? So I'll just like to say that you should try PRP right now. If you are facing the same problem, I'll it definitely help you and we are here to help you. Okay, it's nice talking to you, Dr. Vaseem. Nice okay, yeah.